Good day, good evening, depending on what time of day you may be seeing this video. Uh, I've been having some problems with my pectoralis minor recently. Uh, it's a secondary breathing muscle, uh, and it has several attachment points, which include right around in here the um, coracoid process, part of the scapula. It also has three fingers uh, that come down to attach to several of the ribs here. Um, and if it's dysfunctional, it can uh, create some problems in your shoulder blade too, its functionality, as well as all the tissues that, uh, that surround it, not to mention the upper outer portion of the chest. So a couple of fixes I've been working on, I don't want to say fixes, but uh, alleviations of discomfort potentially, uh, is to use my Yoga Tune-Up Alpha Balls. So as you can see, I've perched myself in a corner, uh, and I've placed one Alpha Ball on my uh, on the back part of my shoulder blade, right on the external shoulder rotators, and I place another one right on the upper outer portion of my uh, left side of my chest, right where the uh, pectoralis minor uh, is. And so what you can do at this point, so just so you're kind of uh, killing two birds with one stone here, working uh, the pec minor as well as the uh, areas that it can um, uh, that can be implicated by its by the former's dysfunctionality, uh, then at this point you start to possibly roll up and down. Right, so you directly work into those tissues, or you stay still, sustain, sustains compression, or if you had a little more room to work with, which I don't right here, uh, you would try to move your arm around and create a little uh, pin and spin, or, or pin and stretch approach, rather. So I have another setup here uh, with the uh, Yoga Tune of Alpha Balls, one on each side of my uh, forearm, uh, and then a yoga block sandwiched uh, in between one of the balls and my side. Uh, a cool thing about the uh, pec minor is that it's also in the same uh, connective tissue line as some of the musculature and uh, fascia in your forearm and also to your thumb, right? So if you do a lot of uh, texting, that can actually, believe it or not, impact your uh, pec minor. So something I like to do to, to work on this anatomy train, uh, uh, if I can borrow from uh, Thomas Myers, is to just roll around the forearm. And if you could find a way to also get to roll that... Uh, bottom ball there, the one that's on the uh, uh, the medial side of the forearm, that can also be beneficial. Um, and I would suggest doing this maybe uh, a minute at least. Uh, same goes for the uh, for the previous uh, ball placements on the back of the shoulder blade and the uh, top uh, of the pec minor that I showed you a moment ago. So that's it for now. I hope you found these uh, self uh, myofascial release techniques helpful. Uh, for additional videos and information, go to ClaiborneDavis.com. Thanks very much.